Hi guys, this is Jerry. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to quickly set your wiper blades into service position. What I mean by service position means um, on the MGZS or ZST in other countries, um, you don't want to leave your wiper blades straight up um, because it's gonna damage your bonnet at the front. What you want to do is to set it on service position. So when you want to change your wiper blades or if you do want to wash your vehicle, you're gonna be able to lift it freely so it doesn't damage anything. Uh, so I'm going to do this video in two parts. First part, uh, it's going to apply to the vehicle that has keyless entry functions. The second part is you can have a vehicle that has no keyless entry function. You can use a key blade instead. So it's going to be quite simple. Uh, let's get through it. Uh, as always, if you're interested in any of the MG vehicles in Auckland, you can contact me, jerry at abit.co.nz or contact abit.coe or abitmgomson. We have two dealerships in Auckland, two dealerships in Auckland. And uh, as always, if you um, if you find this video helpful, please subscribe and like the video. That would be really helpful for me. And uh, let's get in, dive into it. First, I want to show you why you don't want to lift this straight up. Um, just like always, you, you have a regular car, you're gonna try to lift this up. Unfortunately, in this instance, it's gonna damage your bonnet at the front. It's gonna have a scratch, and eventually this scratch may grow into a rust spot or anything like that. That's definitely what you don't want to do because the, the metal piece is going to be stronger than the panel uh, over here. Uh, what you don't do is follow the steps to go into a service position. So now I'm in the MG ZST that does come, come with Kili Sentry. So what you want to do is you don't need to switch on the engine so you don't have to put the foot on the brake. All we want is to switch on the vehicle electronic part then immediately switch it off. Uh, then within the 20 seconds after you switch off, just drop down this lever. So let's go through that. Press the button once, you can see the orange light. Press the button second time, you switch on the electronic part and press the button again to switch it completely so there's no light on the push button. Then within 20 seconds, push this lever down. This is the windscreen wiper lever. Just like that, your wiper blades now stay in this service position just on the top. And now you can freely open the wiper blades up to change anything, to wash your front windscreen if you need, and all that things. You can leave it outside as well. Um, but to please remember when you finish using the wiper blades, just put it, push it back and so it's touching the front windscreen. That means when we start the vehicle, it's going to bring it back to the normal position when it's off, basically. So yeah, now if you finish touching it, if you finish doing anything to it, all you need to do is switch on the vehicle again, either with brake or not brake, the wiper blades will go back to your position. So press this button, there we go, that's switched back, um, but do make sure you switch off the vehicle before you get out, so no light on the push button, that means your vehicle is completely switched off. Now we can open the doors and uh, look into the next one. Now the second part, I mean an MGZS that has no key entry, so you, we get a standard key so the key starts. Uh, so what you want to do is push the key inside. You can twist it to just first position. So now we have the screen switch on, as you can see. Um, I'm gonna mute that. And then what you want to do is switch it off immediately. So switch off and pull the key out. Within 20 seconds, when you switch off, you just drop down this windscreen wiper lever, just like that. Now you can see your windscreen wiper is on the service position. Um, what you want to do is you can lift the windscreen wiper freely upwards uh, off the windscreen. That allows you to change the wiper blades if you need or wash your windscreen if you need. And then yeah, just like that. Once you finish, make sure you push them back to the windscreen wiper, uh, back to the windscreen so it's touching the windscreen. So that, what that means is as soon as you switch on the vehicle, the wiper blades will go back to the, its off position. So I'm gonna do that. So push back in. Twist it just to first the position that allows the wiper blades to go back to the off position. Just like that. Um, so I hope you enjoy this quick tutorial. And uh, if you enjoy the video, as always, please subscribe and like the video and uh, share it if you need. And um, consider buying the car from us at Jerry at Abit. Uh, um, we have the Abit MG um, Olmston and Pokoi dealership in Auckland, New Zealand. Thank you very much. See you next one.